Watch original photos and videos related to this news by clicking on the link given in the description below the article courtesy. Please subscribe our YouTube channel Listen News here. If you like the video please like, comment and share the video. France's competition watchdog DGCCRF announced earlier today that Apple will pay a $27.4 million, 25 million euros fine due to an iOS update that capped performance of aging devices. The company will also have to display a statement on its website for a month. A couple of years ago, Apple released an iOS update 10.2.1 and 11.2 that introduced a new feature for older devices. If your battery is getting old, iOS would cap peak performances as your battery might not be able to handle quick peaks of power draw. The result of those peaks is that your iPhone might shut down abruptly. While that feature is technically fine, Apple failed to inform users that it was capping performances on some devices. The company apologized and introduced a new software feature called Battery Health, which lets you check the maximum capacity of your battery and if your iPhone can reach peak performance. And that's the issue here. Many users may have noticed that their phone would get slower when they play a game, for instance. But they didn't know that replacing the battery would fix that. Some users may have bought new phones even though their existing phone was working fine. France's DGCCRF also notes that iPhone users can't downgrade to a previous version of iOS, which means that iPhone users had no way to lift the performance capping feature. Failing to inform consumers represented a misleading business practice using omission, the French authority writes. Apple accepted to settle by paying a 25 million euros fine and recognizing its wrongdoing with a statement on its website.